today we will be discussing cell structure of algae. There are two basic types of cells in the algae, prokaryotic and eukaryotic cell. Prokaryotic cell lack membrane bounded organelles like plastid, mitochondria, nuclei, Golgi bodies and flagella and occur in the cyanobacteria. The remainder of the algae are eukaryotic and have membrane bounded organelles. Eukaryotic cell is often surrounded by a cell wall. You can see here, this is a eukaryotic algal cell and this is a cell structure of Chlamydomonas. So, eukaryotic cell is surrounded by a wall, cell wall composed of polysaccharides that are partially produced and secreted by the Golgi body. Then, plasma membrane surround the remaining part of the cell. This membrane is living structure responsible for controlling the influx and the outflow of substances in the protoplasm. So, membrane bound, uh, bounded structures in the cell like mitochondria, vacuole, Golgi bodies, nucleus, uh, then endoplasmic reticulum, flagella. So, locomotory organs, the flagella, that propel the cell through the medium of the uh, by their beating. Nucleus, which contain the genetic material of the cell, is surrounded by double membrane with pores in it. The content of the nucleus are the nucleolus, chromosomes, and the background material or uh, karyolymph. Next is flagella. The flagella of the green alga Chlamydomonas have been used as model of flagellar structures. A flagellum consists of an exoneum of nine doublet microtubules. Just look at this diagram. This is flagella. And the second figure here flagellum consists of exoneme of nine doublet microtubules that surround the two central microtubules with all the microtubules encased in the plasma membrane on entering the cell body two central microtubules and at the dense plate whereas the nine peripheral doublets continue into the cell usually picking up an additional structure that transform them into the triplet kinase and protein cause the central pair of the microtubules to rotate these central microtubules to rotate within the exoneme so there are also other structures between the microtubules and the basal region of the flagellum like basal bodies next is cell wall and mucilages in general algal cell walls are made up of two components the fib uh, fibrillar component which form the skeleton of the wall and the amorphous component which form the matrix uh, within which the fibrillar component is embedded. The most common type of fibrillar component is cellulose. Cellulose is, uh, cellulose is a polymer of one four-linked D-glucose. Amorphous mucilaginous components occur in the greatest amount in the Pheophyce and the Rhodophyta, uh, the polysaccharides of uh, which are commercially exploited. Allogenic acid is a polymer composed mostly of 1,4-linked d manuronic acid residue with variable amounts of L-glucuronic acid. Allogenic acid is present in the intracellular spaces and uh, cell walls of the pheophyce. Then, uh, phycoidin also occurs in the pheophyce and is the polymer of 1, 2, 1, 3 and 1,4-linked residues of l sulfated at Carbon number 4. In Rhodophyta, the amorphous component of wall is composed of glactins or polymers of glactose, which are alternatively 1, 3, and 1, 4 linked. These glactins include agar. Next is blastids. The basic type of plastids in the algae is chloroplast, the plastid uh, capable of photosynthesis. Proplast with, will usually develop into the chloroplast. Although in some uh, heterotrophic alga it remains uh, a proplastid. The leucoplast or a myeloplast is a colorless plastid that has become adapted uh, for the accumulation of storage product. In rhodophyta and chlorophyta, the chloroplasts are bounded by double membrane of the chloroplast in well. The basic structure of photosynthetic uh, apparatus uh, in the plastid consists of series of flattened membranous vesicle called thylakoid or disc. Just look at this diagram. This is 
uh, structure of plastid. You can see here, this is a chloroplastin valve. These are grana, uh, grana, thylakoid band, DNA, starch, ribosomes. So, the basic structure of this photosynthetic apparatus in the plastid consists of flattened membranous vesicle called thylakoids or disc and the surrounding matrix or uh, stroma. The thylakoid contains the chlorophyll uh, and at the site for the photochemical reaction and carbon dioxide fixation occurs in the stroma part. Next is pyrenoids. A pyrenoid is differentiated reason within the chloroplast that is denser than the surrounding stroma and may or may not be traversed by thylakoid. Pyrenoid is frequently associated with storage product. Pyrenoid contains ribulose 1,5-bisphosphate, carboxylase oxygenase, that is Rubisco, the enzyme that fixes carbon dioxide. Consequently, the size of the pyrenoid will vary depending on how much Rubisco is present. Many motile algae have groups of tightly packed carotenoid and lipid globules that constitute orange red isopot or stigma that is involved in responses to light. Motile algae exhibit three types of responses to light. First is phototaxis, second is photophobia, and third is gliding. In phototaxis, the orientation of the cell movement is affected by the direction and intensity of light. The cells move toward the light is positive phototaxis and away from the light is in negative phototaxis. In photophobia, Photophobia is a change in direction of movement of the cell caused by rapid change in light intensity, irrespective of the direction of the light. Here, swimming cell stop and change the beat pattern from the normal asymmetric flagellar stroke to symmetrical stroke that propel the cell backward. At the end of the photophobic response, the cells tumble and resume swimming in a new direction. In gliding, the flagella stop beating and uh, adhere to the surface or, or an air or water interface. Cells can glide over the surface with the one flagellum actively leading and other passively trailing. Cells may switch direction by changing which flagellum is active. So gliding motility may be a common phenomenon uh, among organisms that live in the thin film of water on soil particles. Photosynthetic Pigments in algae. Photosynthetic algae have chlorophyll in their chloroplasts. So chlorophyll um, means uh, algae have four types of chlorophyll. Chlorophyll A, B, C and D. Chlorophyll A is the primary photosynthetic pigment. And um, uh, in all photosynthetic algae and ranges from 0.3% to 3% of the dry weight. Chlorophyll B is found in euglenophyta and chlorophyta and uh, chlorophyll B functions so photosynthetically as light harvesting pigment transferring absorbed light energy to chlorophyll A. Then chlorophyll C is found in uh, dinophyta and uh, cryptophyta and most of uh, the uh, uh, heterochondrophyta. Other pigments like carotenoids, carotenoids are yellow, orange and red pigments that are usually occur inside the plastid, but may be outside uh, in certain cases. In general, naturally occurring carotenoids can be divided into two classes. One is oxygen-free hydrocarbons, that is carotenes, and the other oxygenative derivatives, the xanthophyll. There are a large number of different xanthophylls with the, the chlorophyta having xanthophylls that most closely resemble those of uh, in uh, higher plants. Then, fucosanthin, uh, fucosanthin is the principal xanthophyll in the golden brown algae, that is, uh, best Lidiophyce and uh, Pheophyce, giving these algae their characteristic color. Then, phycobilly proteins. Phycobilly proteins are water soluble blue and red pigment located on uh, or inside uh, thylakoids of algal chloroplast. They are described as chromoprotein, means colored protein, in which prosthetic group, uh, non-protein part of the molecule, or chromophore uh, is the tetrapyrrole, means uh, um, known as uh, phycobilin. 
The prostatic group is tightly bound by covalent linkages to its apoprotein, means protein part of the molecule. There are two different apoproteins and which together form the basic unit of the phycobilly proteins. To either or are attached the colored chromophores, the major blue chromophore occurring in phycocyanin and yellow phycocyanin is phycocyanobilin and the major red chromophore occurring in phycoerythrin it is phycoerythrobilin. Then mitochondria uh, next is mitochondria and peroxisomes. There are two types of mitochondria in algal cell. Mitochondria with flat lamellar uh, crystal occur in the red algae, green algae and euglenoid and also in uh, cryptophytes. And second is mitochondria with the tubular crystal occur in the heterocons and uh, haptophytes. Glycolate, the major substrate of photorespiration can be broken down by either glycolate dehydrogenase in the mitochondria or by glycolate oxidase in the paroxysome. So, paroxysome is a single membrane bounded bodies in the cytoplasm. Uh, the distribution of two enzymes um, uh, like uh, glycolate dehydrogenase occur in the cyanobacteria, cryptophytes, euglenoids, diatoms and the green algae with the exception of the uh, carophyceae. Next is storage products. The storage products that occur in the algae are uh, two types mainly high molecular weight compounds and low molecular weight compounds. High molecular weight compounds like 1,4 linked uh, glucans, then um, uh, second is 1,3 uh, linked glucans. So, first is 1,4 linked glucans mainly. Uh, under these uh, one four linked glucans are fluoridin starch, then mixofysin starch and uh, starch. Fluoridin starch occur in the rhodophyta and is similar to that of the uh, myelopectin of higher plants and it stains red violet with iodine giving the color similar to that of the strain uh, reaction of uh, animal glycogen. Then uh, the mixofysin starch found in the cyanophyta and uh, mixofysin uh, starch has similar structure to the glycosin. Starch in the chlorophyta, starch is composed of amylose and amylopectin. It occurs inside the chloroplast in the form of starch uh, grains. Then 1,3 linked glucans. Here 1,3 linked glucans first is uh, laminated. Uh, in the Phyophyce, laminarin consists of a related group of predominantly 1,3 linked glucans containing 16 to 31 residues. Then, um, the second is uh, chrysolaminarin. This uh, um, means in uh, Basiliophyce, in Phyophyce, and consists of 1,3 linked D glucose residue with two 1 to 6 glucosidic bonds per molecule. Then, paramyelin. In euglenophyta and uh, xanthophyce and also uh, in uh, uh, paramyelin occurs as water soluble single membrane bounded inclusions of uh, various shapes and dimensions outside the chloroplast. Third is fructosins. Uh, it has it has an insulin like storage product consisting of series of one to linked um, uh, fructose unit terminated by glucose uh, the end group. Second type of the storage products are low molecular weight compounds uh, like sugar, glycosides and uh, polyols. Sugars in uh, chlorophyta and euglenophyta form sucrose as a reserve food. Glycosides, the here um, uh, glycosides, glycosides like glycerol uh, glycosides and uh, fluoridocyte then polyols like mannitol occur in rhodophyta and uh, phyophyce. Thank you.